The butterfly effect refers to the way a tiny change in a complex system can completely change the entire future of that system. That's a fact of physics in our everyday world. A famous example is weather forecasting. It's been said a butterfly flapping its wings in Brazil can eventually trigger a tornado in Texas. So, if the butterfly sat another five minutes on a flower, the tornado wouldn't happen. If you could time travel into the past, then you might unrecognizably alter the present you left just by catching a butterfly. We can't time travel yet, but researchers at Los Alamos National Laboratory wondered how the butterfly effect works in the quantum realm. Quantum physics governs our world at the atomic scale, scale things up to our everyday world, and so-called classical physics apply. At the quantum scale, parts of atoms, atoms themselves, and molecules are often entangled with each other. Disturbing one disturbs all the others it's entangled with. And when you measure, say, the spin of a particle, you alter it and those around it. Binyan and Nikolai Sinitsyn predicted, theoretically, that adding small damage by measuring something in the past of a quantum world does not significantly change the present. The butterfly effect does not exist for quantum systems. However abstract this theory looks, the Los Alamos scientists could test it at the quantum level on a quantum computer. In their experiment, they ran qubits, or quantum bits of information, through gates that operated on the qubits. In a quantum computer, you can run the same process forwards or backwards. In the experiment, the backwards process imitated time travel to the past. Here's how it worked. An imaginary physicist named Alice prepared qubits in the present and ran them backwards through a quantum computer. Bob went into the past to change this piece of information. Then the system was run forward through the gates, back to the present. In classical physics, everything in the present would be dramatically changed. However, in the quantum world, it wasn't. Despite Bob's intrusion, Alice's work was hardly altered and the present remained essentially the same. These findings suggest new ways to secure or even hide information on computers. But that's a subject for future research.